Hello, beautiful souls. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to today. Welcome to a new day of new emotions, new feelings, new beginnings, and new endings. <laughs> so I wanted to come on here as my authentic self and just remind you guys that just like nature, you are nature. You have your sun and you have your rain, you have your wind, you have your thunder. And our beauty is when we are expressing our nature. And what I mean by that is we are emotional beings. We are feeling beings. We have come to this planet to feel deeply, to be in our emotions, to have emotional intellect to be truly emotionally intelligent. And the way that we become emotionally intelligent is by first expressing, knowing our feelings and our emotions without shame, without guilt, without blame. If you guys are anything like me right now, I was going through it today. I was going through it today. I was crying, I was screaming, I was frustrated. I felt like the world was going to just fall on my head and I didn't know how I was going to go on. And what brought me out of that was reminding myself, number one, I'm okay. I had to remind myself I am okay. I had to remind myself that I am safe. I had to remind myself that I am secure. I had to remind myself that just because I was in my rain, just because there was a thunderstorm, an actual probably thunderstorm inside of me that was going on, that the sun will come back. I had to remind myself that at the end, at the, at the end of a rainstorm, it's always a rainbow, always. And everything in our nature shows us these cycles. The sun shines, the rain falls, there's thunder, there's lightning, there's volcanoes, there's hurricanes. And just like the weather, just like nature, we still have that ourselves. We'll have moments of great celebration of sun and rainbow. And we'll have great devastation of tornado and hurricane. And the way that we experience these feelings, these emotions, are our keys to our own emotional intellect. It's about expressing and not repressing when we are in these deep states of emotions. It's so easy to repress the anger and repress the sadness. And sometimes it's harder to just cry your eyes out, to scream at the top of your lungs, not at someone, <laughs> but by yourself without projecting. This is how we gain emotional intelligence, by truly feeling deeply. And when we feel deeply, we release deeply. And when we release deeply, we then let it go and we allow the sun to shine again. So if you are going through a season of weather right now where it's just constantly thundering, constantly raining, honor that. Don't shame that. Don't suppress that. Be in it. Show up as your own authentic self without makeup, with your hair up, with a sweatshirt on, unapologetically, knowing that you are beautiful, not only when you are dialed up and ready to go out, but also when you are crying and when you are frustrated and when you are angry. Know that there is beauty in the rain. Know that there is beauty in the lightning. Notice that there is beauty in these formations. Be the nature, be the beauty, and don't allow anyone to suppress that because you are beautiful in all of your seasons. You're beautiful in all of your nature. You're beautiful in all of your emotions and all of your feelings. So if you are in the need to just let go of whatever emotions that you are keeping within you, allow this to be your permission slip. Allow this to be your sign. Thank you for allowing me to show up as my own authentic self without apology. 
to give you permission to do the same. There was a lot going on, you know, globally right now, astrologically. You know, the world is a hot mess. It's expressing its emotion. We just went through a new moon and a solar eclipse. And yesterday was um, a day where, you know, a lot of, um, unfortunately, it's uncomfortable to talk about, but yesterday all around the world um, groups of people get together for evil forces to take away compassion and empathy from themselves to then um, manifest people without empathy and people without compassion to create more darkness in the world and yesterday I went to a ceremony of compassion I went to a ceremony of kale that did just the opposite that brought light and compassion and love into the world to to you know exit out that negative forces i'm also in my saturn return right now i'm going to be honest this season of my life is not a pretty time um i cry every day every time i go to yoga i am hysterically crying and i'm honoring it without shame without guilt um i'm also on my moon right now so i'm even more emotional and i'm honoring that and i'm giving you guys permission to honor yourself too don't repress it. Feel it and then let it go. So I hope everyone has a beautiful day. Know that you are beautiful. Know that you are loved. And most importantly, know that your humanness and your seasons are gorgeous. No matter if it's snowing, it's falling, it's summer, or it's spring. Have a good day, guys. I love you.